Are you thinking about getting a Boston Terrier and you want to know what they love? Or do you already have a Boston and you're just curious as to what other owners say their Boston loves? In this video, I'm going to cover the top 10 things Boston Terriers love. Coming up. Hey everybody, welcome to the Boston Terrier Society YouTube channel. Consider subscribing if you're someone who wants to learn more about the breed, learn what it's like to be an owner, hear expert interviews, as well as connect with other Boston Terrier lovers just like yourself. I'm Donnie Gardner, the founder of bostonterriersociety.com. Over here is Bella taking a nice nap in the sun. She's my Boston of over 10 years. And today what we're gonna do is actually go over a post that I posted on the Boston Terrier Society Facebook page. There I have over 14,000 members and I just asked, you know, what does your Boston Terrier love? Breed specifically. Because I think it'd be interesting just to see what's relatable with all of our dogs that are really spread throughout the world within this community. We went ahead and narrowed it down to 10 things and that's what we're gonna cover today. From the least common to the most common as far as being number one. If something is relatable, be sure to put it in the comments below because there are people that are watching this video that have never owned a Boston and they're thinking about getting one and this could actually help them. Let's get into the top 10. Coming in at number 10, rolling in the grass. I can testify to this because Bella, anytime we go outside, if she's not laying in the sun, she is rolling in the grass. I think it's just her technique to actually get some belly rubs, but yes, Boston Terriers love to roll in the grass. Coming in at number nine are sticks. While I wouldn't say Bella is a Boston that loves sticks. I mean, she will play with a stick from time to time. Apparently, some other Boston owners say that sticks is one of the things that their Boston Terrier loves. Number eight are car rides. Yes, Bella loves to go on car rides. She prefers to sit up front, but here recently, you know, after we've had two kids, one of my children are three years old, it's safer to put her in a crate. So we actually bought a nice crate, has a pillow in there, and that's where she goes on our car rides. But before that, she likes to go all around the car and hang out. And yeah, she loves to go on car rides. Coming in at number seven, pretending to be the alpha dog. It's funny. And this is really the only time that Bella barks. If someone knocks on the door, it sounds like we have a bull mastiff. We just have a little tiny Boston. And as soon as they come in, you know, it's complete opposite. So they sound like they're some kind of attack dog. Other Boston Terrier owners have, have mentioned this, which is pretty funny. Number six, treats and food. Yes, Bella loves both. Lately, I don't know if she's having dementia or what, but the normal thing to do is take her out in the morning and then I bring her in and feed her. But now every time she goes out and comes back in, she acts like she hasn't eaten for the day and is begging at the food bowl. That's something I'm personally working on. But yes, Bella loves food. If you've never had a Boston Terrier, this is one thing you're going to have to worry about is anything dropping on the floor, your Boston's gonna run for it and grab it. At least that's been my experience with Bella. So you wanna make sure like things like chocolate, anything that could be harmful for dogs, grapes, you wanna make sure that they can't get their hands on that because Bostons love to eat. Number five, this is very unique to Bostons, frogging. Basically where they lay all spread out looking like a frog. I don't know how Bella gets her legs bent back like that. That is something that Boston Terriers do. And if you've ever been on the Facebook page, every Friday, people start posting frog legs, frog leg Friday. That is a common Boston Terrier trait. Coming in at number four, sleeping. Yes, Boston Terriers love to take their naps. As you can see Bella here, I don't know, this might be nap number three and we're, uh, it is 11 o'clock. Yes, Boston Terriers love to sleep and take their naps. Coming in at number three, throwing a tennis ball around or just balls in general. Bella, even though she's 10 years old, she loves it if we're throwing the tennis ball around. Sometimes she doesn't wanna do it and that's pretty funny too, where I'll throw the tennis ball and I'm the one that's chasing it. But either way, yes, Boston Terriers love their tennis ball. Number two, and this is a big one, Boston Terriers love to cuddle and snuggle. If you're someone who's thinking about getting a Boston Terrier, this is not the breed for you. If you do not want a dog that is gonna literally be by your side when you're on the couch or wanting to snuggle up at any opportunity they get. Otherwise, Bella, unless she's taking a nap, or of course, if I'm shooting a video, she doesn't wanna be next to me. But any other time, she's wanting to be right there. Boston's love to snuggle. Now, coming in at number one, laying in the sun. It blows my mind because Bella, each, I call her my little sundial. Wherever the sun is, that's where Bella is. Right now you can see that the sun's coming up and Bella's laying right in the sun. She will literally grab her bed at times and move it to where the sun is, or she's just moving throughout the house. Like here, once it's like one o'clock or whatnot, she'll go to the kitchen, 
capture some of those sun rays. Then she might move into the bedroom, capture those sun rays. If I take her outside and it's a really sunny day, you know, I'm taking her to go potty and she will just lay down and not move at all. This is number one because every Boston Terrier owner I've ever talked to can relate to this and they've mentioned that their Boston loves to lay in the sun. Those are the top 10 things Boston Terriers love. I hope you enjoyed this video. Question of the day, what does your Boston Terrier absolutely love? Put in the comments below. If you don't own a Boston, let me know what stuck out to you the most or what do you particularly like that Boston Terriers love? Do you love that they are snugglers and cuddlers? Do you like it that they love to lie in the sun? Just put in the comments below. I'm curious to see what you guys come up with. Now, if you wanna learn more about Boston Terriers, subscribe to this YouTube channel just so you can get the latest from Boston Terrier Society. Or if you're still on that search, go ahead and check out this video I did where I covered the 20 things that make Boston Terriers the best dog in America. Or you can check out one of my other latest videos here. And until next time, life is better with a Boston. Say bye, Billy.